So one question we're asking people today, if college and university should be free? Absolutely. Everybody deserves a free education. Okay, and how are we going to pay for that? That's a very good question. How would we pay for that, Nelson? Nelson? No idea. From the very, very wealthy people. Should college and university be free? Yes. Yeah. And how do we pay for that? The government, well, should, taxes, cover, the government, the government. should cover it. Yeah. Aren't we paying for that anyways then? If that's through government taxes. So you would are you suggesting higher taxes then? Well, mm -hmm. Europe has higher taxes. Okay. They have free education, right? Mm -hmm. So if you're looking at a system that already works, that's, well, depending on what your views are on politics, their system is free education but higher taxes. It's like 50%, I think? I don't know. Depends on the country. Some of them go up as high as 50, Norway, stuff like that. Um, so you'd propose higher taxes to cover the costs here? I mean, I haven't, I don't really know what I think about higher taxes yet, so I can't give you an answer for if, that. If they do higher taxes, then they should do higher wages. Yeah. Everything balances out. Wouldn't that just be the same situation then, if we're raising both at the same time? Mm, I think I think it balances itself because they're going to increase the they'll increase the taxes, but they haven't they don't do much to the wages. They they always increase the taxes, but they don't do much to the wages. So you'd like to see an even higher minimum wage increase? Yeah. Do you have a suggestion as to what it might be? I don't. No comment. <laughs> uh, who are we considering wealthy people? How much money do you have to make? That's not up to me, to me, for me to decide. That would be up to somebody else. But you, but you just made the suggestion. Or we can make tax cut and tax cuts in other areas. Don't ask me where to be able to pay for free tuition to invest in our youth. Hey, we're just asking people if college and university should be free. Uh, yeah. Okay, and how do we pay for that? Um, by not electing Doug Ford. Okay, can you explain? Uh, Doug Ford is changing a lot of things about the education system that. Um, He's basically cutting a lot of funds for many things, and I think that's bad because next year for my school, we might not have a lot of sports. Class sizes are going to be like a lot bigger, and teachers are going to struggle more. And what does that have to do with paying university and college? Because he also uh, cut the funds for OSAP, and for people like me who can't totally pay so much for university, we're going to have to find other ways to get money. Okay, so is there any situation where you think that maybe the, per the person seeking the education should have to pay for it for themselves, or do you want completely paid for, or do you want just some base level help monetarily for people who are le uh, have less income or anything like that? Um, I feel like if it could be free, that would be the best option. I, have no I don't know how exactly that would happen, but I feel like we live in a really nice place in Canada where things like that can be very possible. All right, today we're asking people if college and university should be free. Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah, that'd be good for us because we're going to university yeah, next yeah, year. Yeah. Okay, and how do we pay for that? Tax money. Yeah. So increase taxes? Mm, Borns, what do you think? You're good at this stuff. <laughs> no, I don't think it should be free. All right, and why not? There's no legitimate way to pay for it. Okay. And do you think that uh, student loan debts should be forgiven? Uh, unfortunately, no. It sounds like a good idea, but without a way to pay for it, I think it would just end up hurting the economy. Don't be afraid to talk to Andrew. My singing career is coming up. Dropping mixtape July. Excuse me, Miss, you want to do an interview? No? No words? Miss, you want to do an interview? Okay. You know, just pretend to talk about stuff while people walk by. And then you ask them. That's the winning strategy. You guys want to do an interview? One question? A nice family interview. You all look wonderful today. All right, have a good day. I tried, didn't work. Should garage sales be free? My next question. Go up to a garage sale, ask them if it should be free. How am I gonna pay for this stuff? You know, somebody else will, that's all. I think it should be a hell of a lot cheaper if not completely free. How do we pay for that? Well, that's the hard part. So it's the politicians are supposed to figure out. Okay, any suggestions? I mean, I'm definitely more left-leaning and think that I'm in favor of like higher taxes for lower education, but just my opinion. Okay, no problem. Thanks a lot. Okay, no problem. Uh, we're asking people if college and university should be free. That's a good question. I think, yeah. How do we pay for that? Not my problem, it's free. Okay then, so one of the proponents that makes um, government 
paid for uh, post-secondary education a little less valuable is that when you give uh, schools like a blank check to the government it, it kind of raises the tuition prices which is a problem we have now where there's so much student debt and everything because you don't uh, you don't get that erased from your record ever even if you claim bankruptcy so the institutions kind of know that they can set these tuition prices and when a lot of people are using government loans it's still automatically going to get paid back so it's you know you're going to get your money paid back do you have any comment on on that as it adheres to that <laughs> no idea. No? <laughs> okay. That's I okay. come from a country where education and university is for free, mm -hmm. and I don't think it's a good thing because it's very, very overpopulated. Everyone ends up going to school. No one gets proper education because it's very overcrowded. And at the end of the day, everyone's a college graduate, but no one can find a job because you didn't really learn much. It's almost what I've been telling people, isn't it? <laughs> oh, is it? <laughs> I thought you were pro. <laughs> uh, no, I'm de I think that... Uh, like, Overly free education devalues it, the. Uh, it exactly. It really to, does. You have to appreciate and kind of put a proper value to your education. Uh, not a lot of people need all the education that they get, and not everyone works with that degree. So, kind of have to put a pro and con against like how much do you want to pay for an education? What do you want to do with that for a career? So, did you come from Egypt as well? Yeah. Okay, so what do you say to, because we're getting a lot of people from here saying that it should be free, and they point to countries like, they probably just don't know about Egypt, they, they po point to Nordic countries and places like that. Where who, they have free education. Correct. What would you say to those, those people to convince them? Um, I don't know, like, I, I, I don't personally know anyone from that kind of education, uh, or like from that kind of background. Well, just people who think that the education should be free, because a lot of younger it people do. It not mean anything if it's free. You're not yeah. getting the education. The fact that you're spending the money to get the education means that you care enough that you're actually going to work hard for it. But if you're not getting the money, you won't care enough to actually do something to succeed, to want to find a good job, to want to better yourself and just drive your career if it came easy like easy come easy go right if it came easy to you it's not you're not gonna work hard for it I think it should be free it would be great for everyone right save money although honestly I don't think the government will make it happen right if it did happen though it would benefit many people many people from unfortunate families so that they can go to school as well and many people come out of university with so much debt that they just go into depression or you know what I mean it, they're not able to push forward to what they want to accomplish and so making it free would benefit everyone but fortunately I don't think it'll happen right with the way with the leadership we have at the moment so do you have an idea of how we, we would pay for that because that's obviously gonna be probably in the billions of dollars do I have an idea do you want higher taxes? I do not which is why I think it will never happen okay yeah. all right anything else you want to add um, make it free if you can that would be great for all of us what do you think i don't think it should be free no 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 i think that it kind of if everyone has the same education then it kind of devalues that education yeah. and a lot of the times i think the reasons that the tuitions are too are so high is because the t institutions get a lot of the go government money from a blank check in the form of student loans that we can't get rid of like yeah. even what i've been saying today is how um, even if you claim bankruptcy or something, your student loans don't go away. Yeah. They always have to be paid for. So the yeah. schools know that, and they have no incentives to really lower the cost of tuition because they That's know true. they're going to get paid the money. But to ask you to come back at you, what would you say to people who say, like, the Nordic countries and places like that have found a way to pay for free college and tuition? I think a lot of those countries are, their societies are fundamentally different than ours. They, those people have grown up... Uh, accepting that they're going to pay more taxes. Uh, I think in North America we are proud of our liberties that our government has given us, that people should be able to manage their own money. Uh, and I think our system works a lot better. Sure, there are some unfortunate consequences, like some students obviously unfortunately have uh, massive student loans. Uh, but I think that raising taxes would just destroy our economy. Okay, what we found out today, guys, that a lot of younger people of course want it to be free for everybody, free education, but they're not sure how to pay for it. Some people said higher taxes, some people say we should just pay for it outright. But what we also found is some people from places where the education is free find that we shouldn't do it here. We shouldn't imp implement a system which devalues the education. And remember, always manscape. That's another thing, mankind, young and eligible. Not sure what that means, but I like it.
Thank you.